Hey ya! And how was your Monday day? We're almost in February, which means there's more snow. No? Um, we're almost in February, cause it's always cold. No? Try this one more time. <clears throat> We're almost in February because it's Valentine's Day. Woohoo! 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 <laughs> Anyways, um, I'm not really sure what that little woohoo thing was about, but I wanted to warn you, Valentine's Day is coming up. Um, do not spend any money. Don't get anyone any love things. Don't even smile. You know why? Do you know why? Because it's giving in to commercialization or something like that. And I also don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> so today, um, I did a little experiment trying some drinks from different cultures. Okay, so the first one is called see if I'm saying this right because I think I might be saying it wrong um Malta Malta I don't know Malta Goya I know what Goya is because I've heard of it like um there's a sauce that I like to put you know like potatoes or you can put it on like fish and stuff it's so good they have some really good seasonings so anyways this is what this is now uh, some of the ingredients that I read on it, actually, one of them is hops, but this is non-alcoholic, but I'm going to still try it. It's a uh, Puerto Rican drink, something like that. Yay, America. It's not bad, but you know what is very inquiring taste is the very bitter flavor at the end. And, um, it's very rooty and definitely the hops is like a very unique flavor to that. Uh, on the bright side, there's a lot of fructose, like lots of it. So if you're worried, don't worry, it's there. <laughs> um, all right. And then you guys ever had Pellegrino? So, um, it's... Apparently, it's uh, sparkling natural mineral water. I love carbonated uh, waters. Like, okay, so there's this place about like an hour and a half fish or more away. It's called Manitou Springs in Colorado. And um, they have a mineral springs, a few different ones. And, oh, man, people do not like their water. But I get gallons. Like, I'll get a gallon or whatever and, like, fill them up. Because it's free, so you can get as much as you want. Like, a little fountain and stuff. People say that there's, like, luck or whatever. Honestly, how is an inanimate object ever going to make my wishes come true? Unless it's the mineral water, which they do. So, perhaps, perhaps. All right, um, I love this stuff. Mmm. Mmm, mmm. It's fresh. <sighs> it's like, you know, like, have you ever thought about being, like, for brunch? You're always thinking about, like, like French people, you know, like, brunch. Like, mm, I'm gonna have a baguette. And then you have, like, some Pellegrino to go with it. I think that's the kind of, like, brunch I would have. Because otherwise it would be mimosas. I don't drink, so mimosas are kind of out of the water. But Pellegrino. It's pretty good. Um, and then, um, okay, so the next place uh, was Chipotle. Um, I really like the burritos. The burritos are really good. Now, I want to explain something to you. Um, I love buffets. I like restaurants where you can create your own food. Um, like Subway, for instance. They have really good food there. But, um, Chipotle. I mean, how are you guys ever going to know how good food is if you don't take a look at that? 
Do you see that gushing out? <laughs> Why would you not want it? I'm just saying. Um, and then, you know, after I'm done with that, because <laughs> that was tiring enough. I've always liked these. Now, if you see this and you don't see the label yet and you know what I'm talking about. Yay! High five. Um, so this is a fizzy. Um, I like this brand because it's so delicious. And you know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to pour them all together. Why not? I like all of them. These inanimate objects love me. Man, I wish I could have a perfume that smelled like this. Because, you know, I would. Like, like yo, you don't understand. Like, most perfume, like, okay, so I went to Walmart, and there was this perfumes that had, like, that alcohol -y smell. And it's not like the, <laughs> it was like, woo! You just cut yourself, you know what I'm saying? Like, I need to put antibiotics on that. That kind of stuff. No, 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 it was disgusting. Like, I can't wear perfume like that. Can you smell it? <laughs> Smells good, huh? Ugh! Ugh! my life's about right now oh this is beautiful and you know what I should put some burrito dipped in that you know what I'm saying <laughs> Woo! well I did want to say something to you guys um have you ever thought about um organization um I know there's some people who are not very organized and they're extremely messy and then they save everything like the first letter their first boyfriend back in like 39 years ago gave them kind of person. Um, and then you have the person who's like so clean that they throw everything away. In fact, one day you come home and your like couch is gone and they're like, what the fuck? And they're like, oh, sorry, I had to clean. And it's like, why? But hey, it is what it is, right? So... With that being said, um, I just wanted to say I did a little bit of organization today. And you know, organization is beautiful. I'm telling you, it's beautiful. It's awesome to know that um, when you're organized, you can find your things easier. It's uh, more comfortable to, like, you know, be comfortable in the home that you're in. Um, I definitely do enjoy... Um, the aspect of feeling awesome knowing that I have stuff that isn't hidden away that I'm not using. Because let's be honest with each, with each other. Sorry if this has a combination. Um, let's be honest with each other. We all do it. Um, I know that I definitely have a problem with that. So to, you know what I did today? I did a lot of organizi organizing and giving things uh, to a charitable good uh uh, thrift store that gives um, clothes to the homeless and stuff and it's really beautiful they give out food and stuff um, and I just I mean I'm not saying this cuz like I'm <laughs> I did a charity like no like I I'm I hope you guys would hope like I wasn't throwing in the trash you know or like cuz I used to throw my clothes in the trash and my friends would be like what are you doing and I didn't know <laughs> I didn't care so um, I'm a different person now, and I do care, and so I just want to, you know, see change in, um, in human beings, you know, friends and family and foes and woes and all that stuff. Um, and you know, it's getting the new year. Spring is coming up soon. You guys should do that too. Do that now. You know, clean the house, get rid of things you don't need, or reorganize and stuff. Um, get some underwear, you know, nin you know, knit some socks, whatever you need to do, uh, mend them. 
Um, because, you know, spring is going to come around and then, you know, you want to be outside the whole time, you know. So do it now. So that way you have the whole summer and spring and fall to like, woo, summer. And then summer is like, no, it's so hot. It's like, it's a whole like mess. And I understand. <laughs> this drink is seriously fabulous. So let me tell you something. If you are thirsty, if you just want some good tasting, delicious drink, all you need is some Pellegrino, some Izzy, some Goya, uh, non alcoholic. <laughs> Hopefully. Goya! And and if you want to throw in a burrito, you do so. But you'll get yourself. <laughs> you'll get yourself! Oh, for days. <laughs> Anyways, um, I hope you guys are having a good Monday. I hope that I had helped you have a better day than perhaps you had today. And uh, you're probably like, what is she doing half the time? But hey, thank you for sticking around. Thank you for being my friend. And um, I just want to say thank you to all my friends out there. So I have some guest speakers who are going to be uh, interviewed by one and only <laughs> me. And um, I'm really excited because they're really good friend of friends of mine. And... Um, they are very inspiring, and I always go for the people who, um, we all have it rough, you know what I mean? We're always having to go through stuff and, like, have adult, you know, errands and stuff. But it's how you deal with the situation that really impresses me, and, um... Yeah, no, they're, they're really good. They're really good friends of mine, and they have really good things going on in their life. And I wanted to share it with the world so that the world can see that... Also, you can do anything you put your mind to. Do not allow anyone to discourage you. The moment you, they discourage you, don't be mean to them. Just give them a big hug and a kiss on the eyebrow, if they allow you to do that part. And just tell them that you love them and you're sorry they're angry, but that um, when they're ready to talk and, and you know, um, that, that you're there for them and uh, you'll help them through the situation. Because, um, you know, that's what we do as human beings. Um, don't allow people to go um, unheard or um, sad. Because this world is too grand of an adventure to allow such small um, things to ruin a soul that you are. Well, um, I'll be honest with you. I don't really have much to say, although I did want to say uh, I have a friend. Her name is Amanda, uh, Amanda Wilson, and uh, she does makeup and she does like makeup palettes and stuff. And um, she's awesome. Totally awesome. I mean, um, Halloween came around and the only reason why I'm saying Halloween because that's usually people know around that date. Um, she had like really cool masks and stuff. Just the other day on Facebook, she had one that was like, like, uh, she was a woman with glass, like, with, like, stained glass. It was so cool, like, wicked, wicked, wicked. Um, but I've always wanted to make a palette, and I can't afford one that's, like, $70. I mean, yes, I can. Technically, I can. But my priorities definitely do not set me there. So, went to Walmart, okay? And I saw this palette... Yes, girl, it's beautiful. Yes, yes, yes. Um, and look at my eyes. They look awesome. I love it. I like, like, crazy makeup. And every day is a new day of, like, fun and, and, and whatever your clothes are like, you know? Like, this whole thing is, like, I'm very accessory, like, very fashionista. So I like to accessorize myself. And, um, I'm my own artist, so I want to express who I am. Um, at my outer periods. So, thank you, Amanda. Mm -hmm. 
Mwah! <laughs> thank you, Brooke. It's so good to see you. And um, thank you, Micah. I appreciate you coming by. And Christine, I appreciate it as well. Um, thank you guys so much. Oh, and Jamie. Hi, Jamie. Um, so good to see you from the restaurant. You look really well and uh, very happy, too. I hope so. <laughs> and I know there's many more of you out there. Um, I love all of you, though. You know who you are. And um, thank you so much for stopping by. Um, hey, you know what? You should comment. You should like. Uh, subscribe to me so you can see what else I have next. And uh, let me know what's going on about your Monday or day in general. Talk to me. What kind of food do you like to eat? I love orange juice and I love fruit. And you know what? Don't tell anyone, but I really like cheese. So, Anyways, you guys have a great day. And I'm going to see you 